Hey there everyone, welcome to a uh, radio related video and uh, this is a video about Global Tuners. I wanted to talk about this uh, great website that's available at globaltuners.com So Global Tuners is a website where you can tune around the world with different shortwave receivers that are online and uh, it's uh, uh, totally free so you can uh, just create an account and um, start tuning around the world so it's a great website if you don't have a shortwave receiver and wanna kind of have the, the feel of what it's like or in my case what I enjoy about global tuners is the fact that I can listen to stations that I will never hear uh, over here in Montreal in Eastern North America uh, many stations broadcast on times and frequencies that are totally incompatible with you know the propagation so you can listen to some stations uh, via this website that you'll never hear before you know never hear in your life maybe so it's pretty cool and it's also fun to you know listen to regular shortwave broadcasts that you hear normally but um, want to listen to it from uh, another part of the world so um, you've got 51 receivers online as you can see right here 51 receivers and if we click you'll see that these are the shortwave receivers available from the different parts of the world so you've got from Australia, Austria, Brazil, Canada, Finland, uh, France, Greece, Hong Kong, Italy, the Netherlands, Slovakia, South Africa, Spain United Kingdom, United States, and uh, Uruguay. So, uh, you know, lots of uh, Hong Kong, lots of uh, great places in the world where you can listen to uh, different stations. Uh, not all of these radios are equal. Uh, what I mean by that is they don't ha have great antennas. Some are, uh, you know, minimal vertical antennas just to make it work. Uh, that will give you some reception of local stations but not some DX for example and some are really really good and actually have very nice antennas on them so it depends on the type of receiver that you're using so all you have to do is uh, for example I'll try to uh, tune in the KNLS 1500 hours broadcast to Asia so I'll use an Hong Kong receiver so here you get this tuning page and you can click tune this receiver one thing that you got to be careful if you have a if you have someone online and you'll see it right here in the, the box at the corner right here if you see someone else tuning the receiver please be patient and ask for the permission to tune the receiver uh, this is not a contest if someone's using the receiver please um, you know be courteous and ask for permission and if the, per the person is listening to something well you know just wait and uh, come back a little later when uh, the receiver is available so here you can see I'm alone from uh, Montreal so there's the audio start button right here on the upper right so I'll just press the audio start and this starts the audio of the uh, receiver and now I will tune the receiver to the frequency I want to listen to which is 9 dot six five five set frequency and of course make sure that it's an AM mode and we've got a volume right here so this is an attempt to hear KNLS from Alaska there's something there is it KNLS I'm not sure uh, what's cool is that you can actually enter a tuning step here and I'll click 5 and start tuning around from that center frequency and say well I'm going to try to listen to some stations there so you can see here something on 9655 and you can take lists uh, like the uh, Japanese uh, Aoki frequency list like the one I'm using right here to uh, actually know what you're tuning around. So it's a great resource and it's a great way to tune stations from somewhere else in the world 
and also to uh, another great feature here is the fact that you will actually uh, you can actually listen to stations here at home but see how it's coming in somewhere else in the world or if it's audible in another region of the world so this was a short little video showing you the Global Tuners website. Great website, so go there, uh, it's really really nice and you'll be able to tune around the world. And of course be courteous, don't use the receivers for hours and hours, you know, it's not your shortwave radio, it's somebody putting it online so that we can tune. So, you know, use it 5, 10, 20 minutes. If there's nobody tuning uh, or wanting to tune, you can uh, listen to a program. But if someone shows up and says, "Well, I want to use, I want to use that frequency," well, I'm sorry, it's you know, it's going to be more curious to uh, actually leave the radio to someone else for, from time to time. It's, common knowledge you, know, you enjoy tuning the radios they enjoy also tuning the radio so just be curious so this was a short video on the global tuners website hope you enjoyed 73s